Um, the very first Salvi Harp I played, while well, I was quite young, I had just started studying at the junior department of the Royal College of Music in London. So this was every Saturday. And we played in a harp ensemble and the Salvi Harps that we had at the college were also used in this ensemble. For me, it was very exciting in the first place to be playing with this ensemble. There were many older children who were much better than me at the harp. They were, it was very inspiring to play with them. It was, it was my harp. It was the one I was allowed to play as the, one of the youngest in the ensemble. And it was just very exciting to be there in the first place. So that's my first Salvi experience. Practice, in a nutshell. Um, yeah, just keep, keep, don't give up, keep practicing. Try and do something every day. And if you need more inspiration, there is so much online now to look videos, recordings of amazing harpists. We have the online world, which is opened up completely to, for inspiration. And try and play for as many different harpists as possible, I think, especially if you're slightly older, to get loads of different opinions and different inspiration also. I think my new favourite is the Diva. I've just met it and it's, very, it's got a very clean sound, it's very easy to play and it also has such a big sound, a big projection, you can do almost everything on it, so it's very exciting to, to meet the Diva. I think they are incredibly important. It's so important for young harpists to see that being a harpist is, is possible, that you can create a career out of playing the harp. And it's so important just to see the amount of different ways you can play the harp also. If I'm right, there's sometimes jazz and electric harp also here, um, all the different types. And yeah, it's really important to see that growing up as you're learning the harp, to see what everything you can do with the harp. And that it's taken seriously. And that it can inspire the community around where the Harpissima is happening, so it's very important. Yeah, I mean, I'm a freelance harpist, so I do a little bit of everything, a bit of orchestra, solo, chamber music, teaching as well. Um, I love all of it. I'm very lucky that I can make this my career. So current project is, of course, Harpissima. And I am hoping to soon record the Tournier Sonatine, it's my plan. And then for orchestral, I will be doing playing in Ariadna of Naxos, the opera next year. I'm very excited for that. And in general, just many orchestra concerts. I will continue to teach and I will put some chamber music concerts together again. I, I also run my own music. As any freelance harpist probably has to do, you need to put on your own concerts as well. So I have many plans for next year. Thank you.